What's good? Welcome to another edition of Sneaker Sports and Life. This is your boy, Sports Guy Q, and I'm back. I know you guys miss me. It's been a while, but I had to take some time to do some things. But this week is about to get crazy. I got three unboxing. Yeah, I went crazy. Um, two of them were pickups that I hadn't. I've been checking out for a while. Specifically, one has been one that I've been eyeing for almost maybe one or two years. Never could find it in my size and actually found it on the go that. The other one um, was a shoe that surprisingly sold out a couple of years ago. Found that one on StockX, which will be a topic of a video I'll do later this week. StockX versus GoDap. Which one is better? Which one has better customer service? All that good stuff. But um, before I get into that, the third pickup, I can't even give you a clue about this one. This one was a pickup that I didn't even expect to get. Um, it was a super surprise. Super kind of, it just dropped into my hand, so to speak. Uh, sneaker, sneakers app, so that kind of gives you a clue what it was. Didn't expect it, but this shoe, when you see it, because not too many people have this shoe. So that's, that may give you a clue to what it is, but definitely a pickup that I'm going back and forth with some things, but got to show you what it look like. That would be, I think that's the next video I'm going to do. Cause I'm still waiting on the uh, delivery from from StockX, uh, but this one had to do this one first from the Gold app. Um, the delivery process ordered this on the 15th. Um, got it today, so roughly eight to nine days. Pretty quick, considering that they had to get it from the seller, send it to the authentication process and send it to me wasn't too concerned because normally when you buy shoes even from champs or Foot Locker, it takes four to five days and i ordered it on a sunday so eight days great timing this as you can see box isn't even open so you guys will get to see what i'm seeing for the first time got the scissors ready let's go As you can see, I don't know if it's going to show up. Got the GOAT logo on there. Got nice packaging. Don't need this box anymore. So, first of all, nice touch. Got the GOAT sticker. Got everything attached to it. Um, actually, just cut my finger. Crazy. So, watch out for sharp objects, kids. Um, I'm going to just slide this off because I kind of want to keep this. Um, guys may not know what this logo is those who are true sneakerheads may um, this also gives you a clue the Dwayne Wade way of Wade. I think this was the I'm gonna give it the, the way away to year of the horse um, as you can see dope packaging dope box um, this is my second way of Wade. Had the veteran day pickup from the same relief from the same silhouette. Love the shoe. Have been looking for this shoe for a while. Missed it on the restock on the Sunlight Station app. And since then, haven't been able to find the shoe. Found this shoe on the Go app. It's used. Um, but when I say this is a steal, it's a steal until I've opened this box and figure out how used these shoes are. So, take you on this journey. So, let's see what it looks like. Go that. Once again, note, our main goal is to be the most trusted marketplace for sneakers. That's why we carefully authenticated this pair for you. Your sneakers have passed a series of tests by our in-house specialists who examine everything from the label to the stitching to the color and so much more. We hope you enjoy them and thank you for your purchase. Go authentication. Great touch. 
Uh, and once again, like I said, I'm gonna be have another pickup from StockX, so I'm definitely gonna compare the two, see which one works out. Now the pair from StockX is dead stock, so that may be a different thing, but it is what it is. And here you have it, the Dwayne Wade, Year of the Horse, Way of Wade too. Nah, just looking at the shoe. I mean, they're so far so good. I mean, you can tell it's been worn, but it's nothing too bad, nothing too out of shape. I mean, there is some little wear marks up front on the toe box, but where it really matters, the scuff marks, you really can't see. Um, so right shoe so good so far look at the left shoe where it really matters i mean pretty good shoe for it to be used and this is where i'll tell you how much i paid for the shoe i paid 50 dollars for the shoe so considering there's no extreme wear and tear on the shoe everything looks to be in order there's no damage up front there's no damage on this one um, even the back heel looks in great condition Let's see if that straightens out on both shoes so this shoe regularly retails let me see if this one on the box i think for 150 dollars so to be able to pick up this shoe for I bid it $45 for it. No, I think it was $35 and I had $15 for the extra fees for StockX. So $50 for this shoe. Um, considering this is a shoe I've been looking for for a while and knew I wasn't going to be able to find it. Um, had only seen it new, small sizes and they wanted $220 on StockX for the same price. Um, and so pretty good condition I'll show you the other shoe as well and so good condition bottom little to nowhere little to nowhere so like I said this is a steal also came with the, the dust bag the year of the horse dust bag so after looking at everything I gotta get a shoe a eight on considering it's a it's a used shoe and a lot of people kind of heard the horror stories. Um, last night they were talking about it on the Monday mid so how somebody bought a shoe and it smelled like cigarettes. Smells, no, no smells, no stenches, no odors, nothing like that. This is a great shoe. This is a shoe, like I said, I've been looking for for a couple of years. And to be able to get it for the price I got it, I can't complain. So, um... Got to give it an 8, 8.5 even. Because like I said, there's no obvious stains, scratches, this, this coloration. There is some markings on the on the, the midsole, but that's from wear. But it's not that bad. I, I have shoes in my own collection that look far worse than this. And I've only worn once or twice. So um, definitely glad to have been able to pick this up. And... I mean, quick thing about StockX and Godak, well, specifically Godak, they sell used shoes. So I think a lot of people are more apprehensive about it, but it's a chance that you take. That you take. Um, like I said, this definitely is a great pair. Got authenticated by the company, and I'm pleased. I got a shoe I wanted. I'm going to wear the hell out this shoe. Um, it's a, Actually, it could be looked at as a fall shoe because of the tan. Um, and the dark hues to it, so definitely glad I picked it up. But I mean, not much more I can say. Um, before I get out of here, I want to thank everybody that's been jumping on board lately, whether it's been on my uh, Instagram page, which is Sports Guy Q, all one word, and definitely those who've been supporting through liking this channel, subscribing to this channel, liking my videos, and subscribing to this channel. Continue to show your boy some love. And this is about to be a, a mad dash rush over the next couple of days. Like I said, this is just a start. I got another unboxing tomorrow. I already got the shoe. It's sitting over here. 
can't show you because if I show you the box, that may be a little bit too much, but definitely glad that you guys have chose to come on this ride. If there's any other sneakerheads out there that you know would appreciate this, let them know. Basketball season is upon us. Dwayne Wade. I already seen a couple of people with the way uh well weight sixes looking on looking to get some more colorways out there in the open before I pick up a pair. Um but said that all to say we'll be jumping on here more talking about more sports. Uh I know I haven't been doing that like I said I will, but it's basketball season, there's a lot more to talk about in the heat of football season. College football is getting hot and heavy, so there's a lot of sports talk to talk about. So we'll be jumping on from time to time with that couple more sneaker reviews um pickups and definitely just general conversation about shoes what you like that's coming out what you don't like that's coming out what's wrong with the sneaker game what's right with the sneaker game because everybody wants to be an ex expert over something that's very opinionated so it is what it is this is your boy sports got q gonna hit you with some b-roll with the uh, up close and personals of the shoe let you guys really get a, a glimpse of what it's about and i will see you very, very soon.